Have you ever wondered how to go and change your lights on a Hyundai car? Follow us along with a step-by-step -step guide. This is a um, 2013, 2014 Hyundai i30 in Elite. So. As you can see, the windscreen's not very clean, so it's got bird splatter and that sort of guff all over it. Now, the windscreen on this one, uh, sorry, the wiper blades on this one, I've noticed are not the best. So again, we pull it all the way up, and it locks into place. Different mechanism for it. Different wiper blade. And we can't roll it all the way over. So you've got a little tab here. Put your finger fingernail in underneath. Give it a flick. It should flick out without breaking your fingernail. So if you're worried about your fingernails, don't. Now you pull it all the way down, open that up a bit more, and then you have to give it a gentle wiggle. Okay, and it will pop out. So this is a, whatever that is, triple O two. Okay, but you will see it's very rubbery. So this, is different than that one. You can't go and replace the whole thing. Uh, sorry, you have to replace the whole thing. You can't just replace the blade. So again, as we can have a look, we have pollen all the way through. We have little stones and things. So we don't want that to go and scratch the windscreen. And same on this side. Oh, we actually have a bug or something in there. We get moved. Ask him politely to leave. So there we go. So we will give it a gentle clean. So we'll do that down here, away from the car a little bit. Give that a little spray. These are just all rubber. So now this is how I do it. There'll be a lot of people that do it other ways, but give it a clean first before you go and blow your money. It might just need a clean. You know, I mean, you may, you know, when you put it back together, clean your window too. Give that a clean. Use some dishwashing liquid, splash it on, give it a rub down. That is looking better straight away. Now you notice it looks, oops, it goes that way. Okay, how do I know it goes that way? Because that's the way we took it off. Okay. So, I'm giving there a bit of a wipe. This is where you get all your spiders and that. But it looks like a banana. And you're thinking, how the heck is that going to go back on there? So, now we take it. We poke it down in. So, you can see, that just fits up in there. Poke it down in. Give her a poke. Grab the lever. And flick. Do not just slam it down. Because when you go down, you will see that's going to go over top, that'll damage the boat. Just give it a wiggle. So when I put it down, it goes like that. Give it a wiggle. And there you go. And there's our spider. He just fell out. So and there you go. And then that one's done. Excellent. Is there any troubleshooting that needs, we need to be aware of? If it doesn't go on properly, you might have it around the wrong way. Yeah. If you leave too much... Um, CRC. If you leave too much of that on there, you'll get a streak on the window. If you um, get the two round the wrong way, you will only get half a windscreen swipe. So just do one at a time. Don't do them both. Because that one there is a lot smaller than this one here. This one here is for the driver, gives a big swipe. That one there is for the passenger, gives a half swipe. So if you get them round the wrong way, that's all it is. Just unclick it, swap it over, or do one at a time. And as you can see, that folded all the way up, so you can do this one. You know, this one here, we can pull it up. Oh no, I can't reach. It means I'll have to go on the other side of the car to do it. Okay, so there we go. We hope that you've enjoyed today's episode. Please follow us next time when we discuss how to go and inflate your tyre.